So currently in Call of Duty World War 2 there has been a Master Prestige glitch going around and many people have glitched their rank to get Master Prestige but what's happened to those who have glitched it? That's what you're going to be finding out in this video plus there is a brand new method that hasn't really been released yet but I plan on posting it down in the description below when I do get the text tutorial here on the channel. But just before we begin with this video, if you guys could leave a like on the video it would be greatly appreciated and of course if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel already go ahead and do so i was going to be posting a ton of videos yesterday i posted an update video of all of the updates and fixes that have been implemented within call of duty world war 2 you guys did seem to enjoy that video so i will be posting more update videos on the channel when the updates are released so be sure to go ahead and subscribe to the channel and turn notifications on so you don't miss any of them with that said, let's begin with the video. So like I did say at the beginning, there has been a Master Prestige glitch which has been going around. It was a very easy glitch to do. All you had to do is go ahead and UI stack the Prestige from the divisions and then you could go ahead and go over to the Prestige option and actually Prestige your character there by simply pressing X to go ahead and do so. Now, right now they have currently uh, patched it by going ahead and not allowing you to Prestige your divisions but there are still other methods which actually allow the UI stack and still get the same exact screen screen where you can go ahead and glitch it technically get yourself to master prestige there's a method with a supply drop that you can actually go ahead and get the x ui overlay where you can actually go ahead and prestige your character using that method instead of going ahead and doing it through division so if you guys would like to see that uploaded here on the channel just leave a like and leave a comment if i see enough support and enough uh, feedback telling me that you guys would like to see that new updated method simply just drop a comment down below and i'll post it in the next few days like i did say i do have a video coming out on actually how to go ahead and actually get yourself in a full headquarters lobby with a load of other players now that method hasn't been posted here on the channel yet but it will probably be uploaded tomorrow as it's a friday and i know many of you guys are going to be playing call of duty throughout the weekend so i thought it suits that day and when i post it tomorrow you guys will see how to do it as well but with this master prestige glitch currently people have been banned for around 48 hours but there has been no reset so i have seen a few people actually get reset but that was because they had actually gone ahead and boosted since day one so they got their account reset and a 48 hour ban just from boosting but for these people who glitched their rank they haven't been reset yet they've just been banned for 48 hours now I don't know, but in 48 hours time, we'd have to wait and see if people's ranks are reset. But nobody said right now, because there is a glitch actually how to unban yourself in this game, believe it or not. There's a glitch on how to unban yourself. I will link it down in the description below, because I know some of you guys got banned yesterday night unfairly. And you guys still want to go ahead and play it throughout this weekend. So I will leave that tutorial down in the description below for you guys to go ahead and actually unban yourself it's very very easy all you have to go ahead and actually do is sign into the online servers when you get the error message switch accounts go into online and then switch back and you guys will then be in your public lobby uh with the banned account believe it or not it's that easy sledgehammer games have allowed so many glitches and bugs in this game i'm not entirely sure how they even got allowed to release it to the public even still to this day all of these glitches and bugs haven't even been fixed uh, I'm surprised they actually fixed the chrome camo glitch where you can actually unlock chrome camo now but even though it looks like shit people aren't very happy and in my opinion what Sledgehammer have gone ahead and done is made it so you have to go ahead and get the heroic weapons out of supply drops to make your camos look good considering that I don't think they're going to be adding any DLC camos uh, not into this game this far or this early into the game I should say or not this early into the game right now anyway so what you're going to have to do to make your camos look good you're going to have to go ahead and actually buy supply drops with cod points essentially making you guys go ahead and spend money uh, but of course i did post a glitch the other day on actually how to get supply drops for free and it's actually a working glitch it does still work although some people are saying it's patched i will update you guys with another method and i'll probably double upload that tomorrow so make sure you guys keep a lookout for that as i will be posting that tomorrow but the score streak glitch still hasn't been patched within Call of Duty World War 2. I've tested it recently and that score streak glitch is still working. You guys can actually get your score streaks straight off the bat. Literally as soon as you join the game you can get your score streaks 
which is absolutely insane. I'm not entirely sure why they didn't fix that. Maybe they've already fixed a ton of stuff and they couldn't add it into the file size. I'm not entirely sure. But we already know Sledgehammer games are very slow on patching glitches. And I'm surprised they actually banned the people as fast as they did for doing these Master Prestige glitches and actually XP glitches in the game itself. There is also a Master Prestige glitch, which I'm going to be discussing right now. What you guys are going to have to do is get two teams of three people with two controllers. You can literally just search the game lag switch in a capture the flag lobby and you guys will be put in a locked lobby where you can essentially get unlimited xp and get some master prestige just from simply having your own game and lobby where you can go ahead get headshots boost i've seen ton of people do this recently even if you search for a capture the flag or search and destroy game in public matches you will notice people have numbers in their clan tag meaning they've been boosting recently it's pretty funny to see that people still don't remove that and it's still the same method that there was back in call of duty world at war when you used to boost on domination that's pretty much what i got for you guys in this video i know this was kind of an update to the master prestige glitch and how to actually bypass your ban if you have been banned in call of duty world war 2 but hopefully you guys enjoyed the video check out my previous videos on screen right now i'm pretty sure you guys will enjoy them and of course go ahead subscribe to the channel as i'm going to be posting a ton more videos like this so go ahead subscribe and turn that notification bell on but other than that hope you guys enjoyed the video hopefully you have a great day and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace